Hey y'all, today we're going to make some DIY bean bags from those plastic packing bubbles that you get in Amazon boxes. I just uh, cut them in half, grabbed a bag of beans from the Dollar Tree for a dollar, they're pinto beans, and I took a piece of parchment and you lay the plastic in there at the open end and just iron it shut. Wait a minute before you peel it or the plastic will come unpeeled too. And I doubled them up. And I'll show you why shortly because we did a slam test with my five-year-old helper to see if the single layer or the double layer plastic was better for these beans. So I made those three. Here he goes. He's slamming it up for me. He really had fun doing this. We did one with a single layer and one with a double layer plastic and the single layer definitely popped and a bean popped out. But that double layer lasted at least 10 good slams from a five-year-old. Here we go. Looking good, that's the single. Oh no, that's the double layer one, I think. So, after my test, I know it's gonna double layer. I'm not gonna cut too much here, but this will be painting the beans, Mario colors, red, green, and pink. And then I was going to get it together and make more of the bags. I kind of pre-cut them all just in half. So one of those bubbles makes one bean bag because you need two halves. Just cutting right down the middle and then the other three sides stay attached. And I also one side had like more plastic so I tried to do that one first. So they would look more uniform on the finished product. Really careful, make sure all the plastic is under the parchment paper so you don't get any plastic on your iron. You iron the one and then put it inside the other and iron the other. And then you're all done with your bean bag. Just rinse and repeat each color. I got about three um, bags from each plate of beans here that I painted. And then here is my box. I'm gonna paint it like bricks for Mario. So you just need a bunch of red paint and a nice sponge brush. make those bricks long and alternate them. All right, next up we're gonna make the tubes for the beans to go down. Now you could skip this step and just get some green solo cups, but I didn't have any. So I painted these cups green. I had to do two layers of paint for it to really be bright enough, but it works. And then I used the cups to trace the holes in the top of my brick. I did paint the sides of that box as well, but three of, three of the sides. I use my exacto knife to cut out those cup holes. I did cut double because the flap underneath is folded under. So I cut out that underneath flap too carefully. Put the cup in there. Oh, I did cut the back off so that way you can reach in there and get the bean bags without having to lift the box up. So I cut that back off. Then I'm gonna put the cups in here. 
and cut out the bottom of them with the X-Acto knife. The X-Acto falls through. And we need to tape these flaps down because they're all hanging out crazy. Just got some painter's tape. Doesn't have to look pretty under here. Nobody's looking at it. And I taped the cuffs in place too so they didn't come loose. I could have hot glued them, but tape worked. And there we go. Just throw your bean bags in. Might need to do it a few times so they get, so they fall through. That green, red, and pink for Mario, Luigi, and Princess Peach. Toss and play. If you like this, please subscribe. We'll make more recycling content. Thanks, guys. Bye.